Welcome back, my beautiful collective. This is G420 Goddess, Tarot for the Golden Gods and Goddesses. Please thumbs up the video on your way in. Welcome back on another beautiful Mystic Monday. I hope everybody had, oh, excuse me, everybody had a wonderful weekend. I didn't mean to make the camera jiggle. Cheers to you and having a beautiful, blessed, positive week. And somebody wishes and dreams are going to come true because while shuffling out of our Muse Tarot deck, the star card came out. So somebody has a vision. They have worked on healing themselves, bringing things to a balance. You now know your potential. You know you are the brightest star. Period. Your light is bright. You're bringing all your wishes to fruition, my beautiful collective. You've healed and you're ready to move forward. Now, before we continue with the Muse Tarot deck on this Mystic Monday, I went ahead and I shuffled. And from our Angels Oracle deck, the card that came out was Wisdom, my beautiful collective. My mind is strong, open, and clear. That's because you have healed. You have taken all that knowledge and turned it into wisdom. All those growing pains, wisdom. Because remember on here, we do not take losses. We learn lessons and we turn those lessons into wisdom. My beautiful collective. Excuse me. My beautiful collective, I had to take a break real quick. Okay, we were speaking on a wisdom card. My mind is strong, open, and clear. My beautiful collective, the angels are letting you know that working on nurturing a deeper connection with your own divine power can help you to deal with changes and challenges with ease and can ensure you become your own tower of wisdom and calming pressure. You know, I fucked that up. Let me start over. The angels are letting you know that working on nurturing deeper connection with your own divine power can help you to deal with changes and challenges with ease and can ensure you become your own tower of wisdom and calming presence in your life. Absolutely, because why? Because you're the brightest star. You took the time out to heal, my beautiful collective. Now you know your potential. My beautiful collective. At the bottom of that deck, we had confidence. When I set my mind on something, I won't stop until I reach it. Again, my beautiful collective, your wishes are going to be fulfilled because you took the time out to heal, my beautiful collective. And from those lessons, you acquired wisdom. So now your mind is strong and open and clear. That's that bright light. And you working with confidence, my beautiful collective. Some of you guys could have became much more intuitive with the moon card. You see what is hidden. That's how bright your light is shining. Aquarius. Cancer Pisces. 
Let's get on with this reading. Whoever I'm talking to, though, you, you are shining bright, baby. You working with an uh, open and clear mind. Oh, that's a lot. Well, we're going to take them. They're going to tell us a story. You have choices, my beautiful collective. So choose wisely with the seven of materials, seven of coins. With the wisdom and knowledge you have acquired, my beautiful collective, and with an open and clear mind, you are choosing wisely. You can't fucking make this up. The star card with the will of fortune. This is all about fate. What did I say? Your wisdom and knowledge is helping you grow. Therefore, with an open, clear, and strong mind, the will of fortune is in your favor. You are choosing wisely with the seven of coins, seven of materials. We got the three of voices, which is the three of swords. So you are, have overcome this pain, my beautiful collective. You no longer sit in this pain. This is your light enlightening you. Turning your lessons into knowledge and wisdom, my beautiful collective. Faith, destiny. You had to go through these experiences, the good, the bad, the ugly, and the indifference in order to learn knowledge, in order to understand what works for you and what doesn't. In order to see the light, my beautiful collective. You can't fucking make this up. And with the Ace of Voices, which we know is the Ace of Swords, this is the motherfucking truth. Whoever I'm talking to. You went from a Three of Swords to an Ace of Swords. Baby, you blessed with knowledge. You learn what that double-edged sword can do. And at the bottom of the deck, <laughs> this is crazy. Somebody is having a marvelous motherfucking Mystic Monday. Excuse my language. <laughs> Somebody is having a wonderful Monday with the strength card. You see how that works? Listen, what does not kill you makes you stronger. And it's all about the knowledge and wisdom. And using it to your advantage. This is what turned you into the star you are today. You are healed, my beautiful collective. And you have a strong personality. Now you're going towards what you want with excitement. Protect yourself, though. Because everybody that comes towards your light, my beautiful collective, does not mean you any good. That's the flip side to that double-edged sword. But we're not dealing with no longer serves us or what's not healthy for us. We cutting that shit off. Mm-hmm. Because we know <laughs> because we know <laughs> baby we strong going forward protect your energy because the good Lord look at this Okay, we got the strength card. My beautiful collective, we have the Knight of Voices. 
So you you rushing in with excitement. You believe in what you have chosen to do. But the most high is saying sometimes you might have to slow down and protect your light, your peace of mind, the shit that inspires you. This is the seven of wands, the seven of inspiration. See, because the good Lord with the six of voices, which is the six of swords, is guiding you to much calmer waters, my beautiful collective. Much, much calmer waters. Away from the pain. Your stability. Your stability is out of this world with the four of materials. You guys are keeping things close to your chest, my beautiful collective. The four materials is the four coins. You saving. But you're definitely keeping things that mean the most to you close to your chest, especially with the night of materials. All kind of offers are coming your way. And you going forward. And this might have something to do with. <laughs> I, I should just give these loves. But, it, but it's going to bring you closer to someone. With the two of emotions. The two of cups. Whatever strong offers that you may have coming your way. You may meet the love of your life, my beautiful collective. You just may meet the love of your life. But you're going to become very close to someone. And this, is, this has everything to do with your star power, my beautiful collective. everything. It's all about the truth. That's all we want to hear. Somebody is having a true awakening. You're closing out something. Again, it's all about the truth. We got the muse of voices, which is the king of swords. You've healed. You're out of your emotions. You healed from this three of swords, three of voices. You're move, moving forward. You're keeping things close to your chest, my beautiful collective. And it has everything to do with your stability. You building a stable foundation with the ten of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. That's where your wisdom comes in. The will of fortune, your faith. You can't fucking make this up. King of Swords. King of Swords. You, you, and we got the five, five of cups under this. So somebody with the five of emotions, they, they, they it's all about. Your intelligence. Is you all about the head, not the heart right now? You came out twice. Aries, Libra, Sagittarius, male energy. And again, this may have everything to do with bringing you closer to someone. With the Knight of Cups, my beautiful... We got the Ten of Cups and the Ten of Pentacles. Straight completion. You are building a strong foundation. Would you be in that main center, that matriarch or that patriarch? 
You are building a strong foundation for a strong family tree. Look at this. Empress. We talking about boss energy. We talking about investing, my beautiful collective. You can't fucking make it up. Somebody is very intuitive. The moon card, they came out twice. Here it is at the bottom of this deck. Somebody walking away from darkness. You going into the light. My beautiful. Whoever I'm talking to, you, you baby, we got the Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. It's all about being in standing in your power, going after what you want and know you are healed. And whatever you manifest, you have the ability to bring it to fruition, to make it real. That had to be the truth because some sometime during this reading, our, our book fell. And I, I didn't even know it, my beautiful collective. <laughs> On that note, I want to say God bless you. This is G420 Goddess, Tarot for the Golden Gods and Goddesses. Please thumbs up the video on your way out. Have a wonderful, beautiful, blessed week. Let nobody steal your joy on this Mystic Monday. God bless you. Until next time, please hit that subscription bell and notification button. We are on our way, my beautiful collective. We are going to continue to grow. God bless you. Take care, my loved ones. Until next time.